God bless you, family. Pastor Fields, Agape Worldwide Ministry, Springfield, Virginia. We greet you in the matchless name of Jesus. This is the day that the Lord hath made. We're going to rejoice and be glad in it. We're thankful to God for, amen, everything, every day God gives us is a new reason, a new opportunity to give God praise, honor, and glory for the things that he has done. We are living in perilous times, dangerous times, tough times, amen, but we're going to trust God. We're going to believe on his holy name. Hallelujah. The Bible emphatically tells us to trust in the Lord with all thine heart and lean not to thy own understanding. But in all thy ways acknowledge him and he shall direct your path. Hallelujah. If there was a time that we need our path directed by God, it is now. Hallelujah. If there was a time that we need to order our steps in the Lord, Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. It is now. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. And we thank God that even in this now time, hallelujah, that we can trust God, we can believe God, that we can put our faith in him. For it is he who has made us and not we ourselves. We are his people. We are the sheep of his pasture. We enter into his gates with thanksgiving. We enter into his courts with praise. We are thankful unto him and we bless his name. How many ready just to bless God? Hallelujah. How many ready just to bless his name? Hallelujah, Lord. How many ready just to explode? Amen. With a praise. Hallelujah. To break out with a dance. Hallelujah. Just to come before his presence with singing. Amen. And magnify and lift up and glorify the holy name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. For no reason whatsoever. Hallelujah. Money might not be right. Situation might not be right. But we bless God and we magnify him and we lift his holy name from the rising of the sun to the going down of the same. His name is worthy. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. His name is worthy. Hallelujah. The pain is not worthy. The situation is not worthy. But great is the Lord and he's worthy. Hallelujah. Thank you. God, thank you. Hallelujah. He's worthy to be praised. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. So we're thanking God. We're praising and magnifying. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. His holy name. Today, my brothers and sisters, we are gathered around the word of God. Amen. Hallelujah. We're going to go the Lord, I woke up this morning and that's the first thing he said to me. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. In the name of Jesus was accept the Lord build the house. They labor in vain that build it. Amen. That is Psalms 127. Hallelujah. Amen. Unless God do it. Hallelujah. It's not done the right way. Hallelujah. Amen. We are home. A lot of us are home and working from home or Amen. Hallelujah. Trying to keep your home or whatever the case may be. Give it over to the Lord today. Allow God. Amen. Hallelujah. To build your house. Allow God to build your home. Hallelujah. Just because you're in the building doesn't mean it's a house or a home. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. As, it, as for me and my house, I could have went to Joshua. Amen. At the, at the close of his life. Amen. He's... Uh, giving his swan song, amen, and, and, and sharing with the family and the elders of Israel. He pulled them in. Y'all come on here. I want to talk to y'all. Y'all living in houses you didn't build. Hallelujah. You're drinking from vineyards you didn't plant. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. And if this seem evil unto you, choose you this day whom you will serve. He said, as for me and my house, we will serve the Lord. As for me and my house, we will serve the Lord. And I share that with you today. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. As for me, I wish you would say that. As for me and my house, we will. Look at somebody in there. Hallelujah. Look at them. Point at them if you have to. Hallelujah. Don't get rude now. Be nice. Hallelujah. 
But as for me and my house, we will serve the, the Lord. Make that declaration every day. Pray over your family members in the Hallelujah. The children of God. If you don't have no oil, amen. Ask Pastor. Ask me. I, I'll send some oil to you. Amen. You can anoint your house and you can anoint, hallelujah, your, your doorpost. Amen. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. If there's any, any time to, amen, while we're quarantined, amen, to have a little talk with Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. And turn your, your house, your apartment, your room, hallelujah, into the house of God. Hallelujah. During this time and, and get into prayer. Hallelujah. If necessary, if God leads you fast and pray and, and turn from our wicked ways, he said, and seek his face. He said, we will hear from heaven. He'll forgive our sin and he'll heal the land. Amen. Except the Lord build the house. They labor in vain that build it. Except the Lord keep the city. The watchman waketh, but in vain. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Unless God is doing it, it won't be done God's way. You might, it might be perfectly, amen, um, built and meet the codes. Amen. Hallelujah. Every code of the county. Hallelujah. But it's out of the will of God. Hallelujah. Uh, it's con construction workers may come and see and look at it. Amen. And marvel at your craftsmanship. Amen. The architects and amen will get great credit for their design and building that house. Whoever designed this did an awesome job. Amen. They thought about this and they thought about that. And they put this here and they put that there. That makes good sense. And because of the location and pointing due east or due west or the, 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 the square or the round or whatever, the oval shape, whatever it may be. Amen. Hallelujah. It, you might get visitors or people coming to see. Amen. How marvelously it's designed. Amen. But w whatever you do for Christ will last. Anything. Amen. According to the flesh. Amen. Will fail. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Man is born but a few women. Uh, uh, man is born of a woman but a few days and full of trouble. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. But if God is doing it, when God is in the building, Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. When God is laying the foundation of it, first of all, the devil can't touch it. Hallelujah. Thank you. Whom I put in my hand, no man can pluck out of my hand. The light shine in darkness and darkness comprehended not. I'm sick and tired of being sick and tired. I'm sick and tired of the enemy having, amen, rule in my house. As for me and my house, we will serve the Lord. Build it on that foundation. Amen. Because there's no other foundation was laid that other than Christ himself. He is the foundation. Amen. Hallelujah. He's the walls. He's the roof. He's the ceiling. Hallelujah. He is the whole house. Hallelujah. Jesus is the whole house. Hallelujah. He told Peter upon this rock, I'll build my church and the gates of hell shall not prevail against it. Hallelujah. Thank you, God. Hallelujah. And so except God do it, it won't be done right. Uh, except the Lord keep the city. The watchman waketh in, in vain. Uh, in other words, amen, hallelujah. You can't be protected. I don't care what kind of security system you have. Get you a rock wallet, hallelujah. A couple of domobins, amen, hallelujah. Whatever else you think may protect your house, amen, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. That, might, that don't always protect it. They make a lot of noise, amen, hallelujah. But don't always protect it. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. But we, when we put our trust in Jesus, he said, David said, in thee, O Lord, do I put my trust. Let me not be ashamed. Hallelujah. We are not ashamed. Amen. Of the gospel of Jesus Christ. We are not ashamed of godliness and holiness and righteousness. Amen. We're not ashamed to do it this way. Amen. According to the word of God, we're not ashamed to cry out to the Lord. Even in our distress, we cry unto you. Lord, because you are the author and you're the finisher. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Talking about construction, talking about the builders and amen, the people that make it and build it. And, amen. We're talking to the creator of the universe. Hallelujah. We're talking to the one that made the dirt, the clay that they make the bricks out of. He made that. The straw. Amen. Hallelujah. He made that. Hallelujah. That was created by God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. The earth is the Lord's, the fullness thereof, the world and they that dwell therein. 
Hallelujah. We trust God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Electricity the system. Amen. Your power go out. Amen. That that security system might go out right with it. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. But God is always on his post. Hallelujah. He don't slumber, nor he neither do he sleep. Neither is he weary. Late in the midnight hour. Hallelujah. I can call on my Lord. Hallelujah. I can look to Jesus, the author and the finisher of my faith. Hallelujah. Except he do it, my brothers and sisters. You're wasting your time. Put it in God's hands and leave it there. Oh, leave it there. Hallelujah. Take your burdens to the Lord and leave it there. If you trust and never doubt, he will surely, hallelujah, bring you out. Take your burdens to the Lord. Accept the Lord build the house, my brothers and sisters. They labor in vain which build it. Psalms 127. Except the Lord keep the city. The watchman waketh but in vain. It is vain for you to rise up early and sit up late to eat the bread of sorrows. For so he giveth his beloved sleep. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. We're worried about the circumstances that we can't control. We rise up early because we couldn't get no sleep last night and couldn't 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 stay asleep and wake up in the morning early in the morning and sit up and, and worrying and wringing our hands and don't understand why we're going through what we're going through. Don't understand the situation that we're going through. We're believers. We're trusting God. We believe in the Bible. We believe in his word. We're paying our tithes. And some of us even paying tithes and offerings that know what it's all about. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. And giving their tithes and blessing other churches and ministry and helping their neighbors. And Lord, if I'm doing all this, why, why do I go through what I'm going through? Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. They that live godly in Christ Jesus must suffer persecutions. Offenses must come. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus told Peter, Hallelujah. Satan desire to have you and to sift you as we, his place is the lake of fire. And he want to take as many people as he can down with him to destruction. So the thief cometh not but to steal, kill, and destroy. But Jesus said that I am here. I am come. I'm here now that you may have, oh God, thank you, that you may have life and have it more abundantly. So what am I going to build my house on? Hallelujah. Am I going to build it on, amen, sin? Am I going to build it on disease? Am I going to build it on what the news is saying? Or am I going to trust in the Lord with all my heart and lean not to my own understanding? But in all my ways, acknowledge him. He shall direct our path, saints. And I'm just saying you're there. You're at the house. Why not make it the house of God? Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Why not throw away and cast out? Hallelujah. The idols and the things that are not like God and that you know that are not like God. It's good. It's good to have. It's spring, isn't it? Hallelujah. Amen. If you're listening in winter, it could be spring. It could be the spring of your life. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Do some spring cleaning. Hallelujah. And get rid of those things that you know that are not like God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. And make the house more godly. Have some prayer. Hallelujah. Amen. And everybody in the house, if you're not a, if you're not by yourself, then you, you don't have no excuse. Then you can have prayer anytime you want. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. You can have worship service anytime you want. Amen. Hallelujah. And so make it into the house of God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. And start serving God with sincerity. Hallelujah. Amen. We know that God has blessed us with every new day and every new day God gives us. We ought to give it back to him and praise and magnify his holy name and lift him up because he's worthy to be praised. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. So it's vain for us to rise up early and sit up late and to eat bread of sorrows to amen, regret and things you couldn't change and things, mistakes that you made. You can't go back and change that mistake. But what you can do is take care of this day. This is the day that the Lord had made. We're going to rejoice and be glad in it and do your best. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. In, in service to God and to the community and to your family. Amen. Some of us, we're so we're nicer to our neighbors than we are to our family. Our own family members need stuff. We won't give it to them. But if our neighbor need it, we'll give them double. Hallelujah. Thank you. Jesus. How can you? 
Hallelujah. Love God who you're not seeing and hate your brother who we see every day. Amen. Hallelujah. Lo, children are an heritage of the Lord. Our children are our blessing. The fruit of the womb is his reward. His arrows are in the hand of a mighty man. So are the children of the youth. Hallelujah. Amen. So are our children of the youth. Our young people. Happy is the man that have his quiver full of them. They shall be, not be ashamed, but they shall speak at the enemies in the gate. Hallelujah. They shall going to accomplish the things God said. They are absolute blessing to the people. Amen. Hallelujah. They are blessing to you and everyone God has placed in your life, young or old, are a blessing to you. Hallelujah. Now, God just told me to share with the people today. Amen. Hallelujah. We're doing a lot of things at home. We're painting on. Amen. How to cleaning out the house. Amen. Hallelujah. That's nothing wrong with that. But just be careful. You don't want to end up in the hospital. Amen. You don't want to hurt yourself. People are hurting themselves. Amen. Trying to do stuff. Amen. Hallelujah. Themselves. So just be careful. Amen. Take care of yourself. Hallelujah. But in it, while you're doing that, while you're spring cleaning the house, literally. Amen. Do it spiritually. Amen. You're doing it naturally, but do it spiritually. Build up the spiritual house where you live. Even if you're by yourself, build up your spiritual house. Amen. Hallelujah. Allow God to come in and save you and deliver you and make, make you whole, make you complete in him. Amen. Hallelujah. Allow the blessings of the Lord that maketh rich and have no sorrow to it. We trust God. We believe God. Hallelujah. We walk in God. So now let's just let's start building up God's house. Hallelujah. Let's start building God's house. Hallelujah. Let's start building God's house. Again, as Joshua said, as for me and my house, we will serve the Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. God bless you, family. Love you in Jesus name. I'm giving you what the Lord gave me to share with you today. Amen. Hallelujah. Accept the Lord. Build the house. Let it, it will be an exceptional house. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. When it's God's house, it's exceptional exceptional amen hallelujah we are thanking god for what he has done hallelujah amen what an excellent house of god hallelujah thank you jesus when god builds it when god makes it whole when when god makes it complete in him what an excellent house amen when it is the house of the lord god bless you family love you in jesus name amen y'all put in your prayer requests I'm going to, I'm getting ready to pray. Amen. If you have prayer requests, amen. Hallelujah. Let me know right now. Those on conference line, those that are listening on podcast, amen. Our contact information is there. Amen. Hallelujah. Put in your prayer requests. Amen. Last night, I put in our prayer request for our Monday night prayer. And young lady came on, had an unspec unspoken request. Amen. I'm not going to share you, share it with you. Amen. Hallelujah. But I just say, pray for her. In her medical situation. Amen. In the name of Jesus. We're praying for her healing. Hallelujah. Her complete healing. Amen. Hallelujah. And I'm calling out. Amen. Some other folk. Amen. The Logan family. In their hour of bereavement. Amen. Hallelujah. Continue prayers for the Cotton family. Amen. In their <clears throat> hour of bereavement. The Reeves. Amen. The, the Gardeners. Amen. The, the, the Vanisons. Amen. Hallelujah. There's a lot of people out there. Amen. That's losing, losing loved ones. And we're praying for all those families. Amen. Suzanne Parker. Amen. Pray for her. Call her name out before the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. For God to heal her. She needs complete healing from the crown of her head to the sole of her feet. Amen. Hallelujah. For God to bless in her situation. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Father, we thank you. We thank you for your blessings. We thank you, God, for this day that you have made. We're going to rejoice and be glad. And we thank you, God, hallelujah, for another day that you blessed us with. And God, help us, Lord God, to help you. Help us to help the kingdom. Help us, Lord God, to help our neighbors, Lord God, hallelujah. Lord God, and families are without, <clears throat> neighbors are without. Lord God, bless every home, every family that's represented here today. Lord God, hallelujah. Every community, Lord God, bless, touch, and deliver right now by the power of your holy word. 
Lord God, all the bereaved families, Lord God, there's lost loved ones, whether the virus, whether it's Alzheimer's, cancer, whatever it may be, it's a means to an end. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. And we, we speak love and comfort, hallelujah, in their hour of bereavement. Bless them right now in the name of Jesus. Bless the business owners. Bless those that, that stand in need of help and assistance, Lord God. And seems like they can't get it, Lord God. In the name of Jesus. Bless sister, uh, our trustee Barbara Gales and her business, her uh, her shop, Lord God. Bless her to stand in, the, in these evil days. And Lord God, all our small business, amen, leaders and hallelujah. All those out there struggling, fighting and try, fighting, trying to make it. Amen. Hallelujah. Every day they're fighting, trying to make it. And Lord God, we ask for your divine hand upon them to cover them and keep them. Shield them. Bless them, Lord God. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, we have the victory. Build our houses, Lord God. Help us, Lord God, to construct or reconstruct houses of worship in our homes. Hallelujah. In the, in the churches. Lord God, hallelujah. And the communities, Lord God, that really need God, hallelujah, that people don't go into, they're scared to walk down that street, Lord God, hallelujah. Build a house of worship right there in the midst of darkness and let the light of God shine in that darkness and darkness comprehend in that. Bless our children. Bless the ones that that's uh, not able to go to school, Lord God, and pray that they're getting all their education and all their academic needs. Lord God, those that didn't chance, didn't get a chance to go to the prom or have graduation like the other kids down through the years. Unwrap a special blessing for them, Lord God, in the name of Jesus. Bless the ones in the hospitals, hospice care, Lord God, maternity ward, in the name of Jesus, Lord God, hallelujah. Those that are weeping over the great loss, Lord God, comfort your people in the name of Jesus. And God bless the churches and pastors and leaders to hear from you and do what you said and build up the house of the Lord. Hallelujah. The house of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Because all other ground is singing sand. Bless this prayer band. Bless everyone that came in. Lord God, that called in. Those that are listening later. Bless them, touch and deliver right now. In the name of Jesus, we thank you. We praise you. We magnify your holy name. Lord God, heal like only you can. Save and deliver like only you can. These are all blessings we ask in Jesus Christ's name, I pray. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. And amen. 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 God bless you, family. Love you in Jesus' name. I thank God for you being with us today for this noonday prayer. This is May, the end of May, amen, We're coming to an end, and around Memorial Day, we have our final wishes, amen, we tell people, let's, amen, put your packages together, every year we do it, amen, this year has special significance, amen, <clears throat> but we want everybody, if you don't have one, I can send you the PDF that we have, amen, so your final wishes that you know, amen, everybody knows, or somebody knows, if you passed away suddenly, who would have you know where your papers are, amen, somebody need to know what you want done, amen, the songs that you love will not be sung, amen, the preacher that you want to preach over you, amen, hallelujah, might not even know that, amen, hallelujah, your favorite scripture, amen, all those things, your wheels and all the, your important papers, somebody need to know where all these things are, Amen. And put it in a nice, neat package. If you need uh, agape, we can keep your file here, your PDF file here. Amen. How to, if you wish. Amen. But we, we want you. Amen. Hallelujah. And your family, your wishes to be done. And we want your family to be able to be blessed. Amen. In the worst time of their life, they got to try to figure out all these different things. And what would you like? And what was this? And where is this? And do we have this to do this? And we have that to do that? And you don't know any of that because, amen, it's not written down. Amen. So every year this time, I do this every year. Y'all know. Amen. So if you want me to send you that PDF, let me know. Call me. Amen. Inbox me on Facebook. Amen. And I'll send you that PDF. And if you already have one, please update it every year. Amen. Please update and renew your PDF because your situation may change. Amen. So upgrade it. 
amen, and let everybody know, amen, your plots, all those things, amen, your final resting place, all those things, amen, they have them online, final worship package, you can get your own, but if you need me to send you one, I will do that for you in the name of Jesus, God bless you family, love you in Jesus name, all that can, please be a blessing to Agape, Cash App, Agape CA is our Cash App, amen, hallelujah, and you can be a blessing to this church and this ministry as we try to help people along the journey i get no money from the companies that do these things amen hallelujah i just seen a lot of problems and a lot of situations uh, a lot of funerals planned 15 minutes before the funeral amen and the preachers picking out the scriptures and the songs and everything amen hallelujah and and the person that passed away needs not even being met so amen hallelujah i think it would be a great thing if we knew what to do for you and what you want so we can serve your family amen hallelujah in that hour of bereavement and we can we can um we can bring your wishes we can have your wishes amen done as you wanted them done some of the best funerals not as you know other than the person being passed away but some of the smoothest uh home going services was those where the person planned it amen and they made their wishes known to everybody so they did what they wanted to do and every and it went well because everybody amen just followed the wishes of the deceased amen hallelujah so amen if you want that done for you please amen inbox me and i'll give you the pdf file or you can go online to final wishes packages amen i'm sure a lot of them are free and fill it out and have it set in a place where somebody can get it amen that know about it and can executors and you know power of attorney and all that stuff needs to be filled out and known by somebody amen uh, i'm sorry to be morbid but that's we do that every year to try to help people set their house in order amen god bless you love you in jesus name our closing scripture first timothy first chapter 17 verse now to the king eternal <laughs> immortal now unto the King eternal, mortal, invisible, the only wise God, be honor and glory forever and ever. Let the church say, Amen. Amen. Show someone the unconditional love of God. This is the agape way. God bless you, family. Love you in Jesus' name. And I'll see you guys next time. God bless you in Jesus' name. Agape Worldwide Ministries and Pastor Renzo James Fields invites you to come worship with us in Springfield, Virginia. We're located 7240 FNG Boudinot Drive in Springfield, Virginia. Call 703-372-1174. Agape Worldwide Ministries. Real love, real people, real church.